name is Greg Wood. Um, my uh, field of study right now is the uh, HVAC, and I served in the Air Force. My decision to enlist came when I was 20 years old. I was attending the University of Kentucky and not doing so hot, so I decided to drop out and uh, refocus my efforts somewhere else, and that led me to the military. My time in the military grew me up fast. Uh, I was kind of a punk kid at 20 years old who thought he knew everything, and then uh, that quickly changed. Uh, my primary job in the Air Force was electronic countermeasures, so I worked with uh, the maintenance crews on the flight line, reprogramming and uh, calibrating and servicing uh, electronic countermeasure pods that essentially scramble enemy radar. The thing that I remember most about being in the Air Force was the connections that I made with my team. Uh, we worked a lot of long hours together. We got to know each other really, really well. And uh, at the end of the day, I consider most of my team, if not all of them, just as close as my family. The one thing that I really learned about myself was that when I put my mind to something, I can get it done. It may not always end up the way that I thought it would, but it'll always work out at the end of the day. The biggest life change for me getting out of the service was losing that sense of community. Um, when you're in the military, everyone knows what you've been through and you know what everybody else has been through and you have that shared identity. Getting out into the civilian world, it is not like that. My decision to attend MCC is kind of twofold. Um, I got laid off from my job that I had been working at for close to two years. And I wasn't really sure what I wanted to do. So uh, I spoke to my father and he recommended that I use the training that I had and I use the uh, higher education that I already had and pursue a uh, college degree. So here I am, I'm graduating in December, so I've been attending MCC for almost two years now. The biggest impact the military had on education was that the best way to achieve a degree or anything is that you have to just keep going. So as long as you don't stop, you'll get where you're trying to go. Being a veteran means a lot to me, actually. Uh, I come from a military family. Um, I'm fifth generation military, and for my family as a whole, we've been actively serving um, since just after the Civil War. So it's been almost a sense of I've joined the club, kind of. Uh, you know, when you meet another veteran, a lot of times you just immediately click and that has had a huge impact as far as uh, making connections in the outside because um, it, is, it is a whole different world.